everybody welcome to another ride along with goggles and uh, here we are with the new skin for the uh, John Ruta 362 cab over Peterbilt and we got the good old Bart's Wilson Silver Star here with the uh, uh, the Hell Creek job, paint job on it that's uh, up on Truckee and uh, yeah we should uh, should ought to get going because I got a a plan here and I messed up my trailer cables I got under cables on the truck so we're gonna uh, stop and fix that on the way and we've got a little plan here this is a really long trip if we go this way and I checked it's 140 miles to here and back if I wanted to double this way and you know it's like to go from here to here is almost 200 miles so let's reroute ourselves oops nope Let's reset navigation. We'll see if we can get it to go this way. No. I want to go like that. There we go. Oh, it still says 423. No, see, it's taking us here and back. And that right there is 100 and some miles. So we'll just head out and go that way and we'll see what happens. And I'll stop in right here and fix the trailer here, the truck cable problem. So we should hop in and get going instead of talking about it. Okay, everything's good to go here. Got the uh, good old DD60 in here. See, what they don't like is you uh, turn on left across this highway here. Now, let's see. Oh, there's a median here. Okay, so we got to turn around. Oh, that's the problem. Oh, I see. Okay. Well. Now, there, it used to be able to go all the way around through this yard, but I tried it a while ago, and those barriers are for real. I'll try and nudge my uh, nose up onto this one, see if it's really... I mentioned it to Recon, and uh, he seemed to think that they were removed. I'm going to damage the truck here. Oh, they're there, all right. Got her in high range here. So things are going to be happening pretty quickly here. I've got to be careful what I'm doing. Turn around. Yeah, that's what I want to do, Lori. Crazy changes here. Got to see if I turn around this little pasture right here. It's going to slow down in case there's some kind of barrier. That ah, looks okay. Yeah, I've talked to Recon about that because it didn't used to be like that. I used to be able to just drive around all the roads I'd driven before in all the roads in this little area. You know, all the service roads in and around the ranch. Now, when we get across here, we'll see what our distance change is like. Oh, you know what? I think I have traffic turned off. I do from that last video. Uh, oh no, something else I was doing. Darn. Let's uh, take care of that. Traffic. 
Okay. And, uh, oh, there we go. They'll start uh, showing up pretty soon. Yeah, it gives us a chance to get on the highway. Now we got 300 miles to go. Yeah, that was a long turnaround there that they wanted us to do. And we've got a scenic route, uh, theoretically. I don't even think I've been on some of these roads. Because it just doesn't take you there. There's no businesses out where we're going, so win-win for us. driving a lot of other engines lately and uh, it's just good to get back in it. Fifteen thousand pounds of weed leaves. Should be four lane here all the way to uh, Clovis where I can fix the trailer cables. You never tried that high speed reverse, you just throw it in high range. And uh, yeah, you can do it in real life, unless it cha changed something in the transmission since I drove. Okay, now, where is this place I want to do the service? Oh, did I just pass it? Oh boy, let's look at the map. Man, we were there in a hurry. I did. Okay, we'll turn right and go around the block. Let's. Yeah, I was expecting a little drive into Clovis. <laughs> there I'm yakking about, oh yeah, it should be four lane all the way to Clovis. <laughs> yeah, as we drive through it. Sorry, Laurie. Gotta do this first. 
think we can go around to the back here. Drive into our... Oh, shoot, there's a truck on the way anyway. Best laid plants of the mice and men. Not that. That. Oh, didn't put them up here. That one. Yeah. There we go. And the little doodads are gone on the back. Perfect. Alrighty. That's better. Now we can go. Oh, did the automatic start thing. Turn right. After one hundred yards, turn right. Oh, would you know it? We've got. What are these guys doing? It just never fails. My word. This is uh, twice in the last little while I've had to turn traffic off because they're uh, they just they're just getting confused. Had a pretty good stretch there. Where we haven't had to uh, worry about them. They've been behaving themselves, but gotta banish them to wherever AI goes for their get into their naughty room. Okay, now, just gotta get ourselves through Clovis and we're underway. It's kind of weird how, how the uh, lift axle works on these, like there's an option to uh, control it manually, but it doesn't uh, go automatically when uh, there's X amount of weight. So even no matter how much weight is on the trailer, I can lift that trailer drop axle, which is a little weird, but uh, like I like to be able to lift it for maneuvering if you got like a trailer like this it's a pretty long trailer and you got the wheels right at the back it, if you can lift that back axle improves your maneuvering ability quite a bit oh they're down now okay well let's see maybe maybe it is we can't put it up oh there they go you can but we'll leave them down because uh 58,000 pounds is enough weight to need them. There are a couple over there talking in front of the church door. Don't do it, buddy. You're better off single. <laughs> not necessarily true. Oh, 
this is one of those uh, take a photo places right here. Right in front of this thing. I oh, will take one, but it won't stop the game to do it. What is that thing anyway? Like some kind of made up jet. Okay, now we gotta start making up some time. Hopefully. Hope these guys don't slam on the brakes here. smoke out of it. I don't know if I've seen that before. Is that new or what? put that uh, no I know I didn't put that camera in here darn it that roof camera you can look around that would have been cool I don't know what just the plain old roof camera is like on this one I forget that front diesel smoking away? John Wayne was always going in the movies. Fort Sumter. These guys get a chance to turn off somewhere here and let us go. Get on with our, our journey. Ha <laughs> 
I haven't seen that before. The old truck up in the rocks there. Yeah, definitely haven't been on this road before. of it, giving this guy the big pass. Man, we should do this. Oh, double line. Solid line. Pass with care. Well, what do we see out here? That looks good. Oh, here comes the bus. Probably stopped by now. Wow, you're still moving. Yeah, we didn't trouble the guy behind us. Oh, good. Oh, man. Oh, yeah, I got the cruise there now in this profile at least. Something. We're too low a gear for it. At this speed. Up this hill and then try again. Now we've got an intersection up ahead. After 100 yards, turn left. to look at this on the map and uh, just remember where all this was and go through there in the other direction someday be kind of cool uh-oh uh-oh hope we don't get pulled into the scale please no yay Enough little diversions here today. Oh, I've been through that. Well, I've been to that way station there before, but I think came at it. We didn't have that left turn we just took back there. Came at it straight in. Oh, man, I didn't see that guy signal. I don't think he did. That truck to the yield. Is he gonna? Uh, yep, nice. One less guy to worry about. That dude in the black plane making good time. Make him fast enough to tear the wings off of that thing. Traffic. Oh man, yeah, we should have gone for it. No, something coming now. Going 50 and a 65. Oh man, those little turquoise buses. Enough to give a guy heartburn. And he's catching the guy in front of him. Oh, it's painful. Not even going 50. Oh, there goes 
is one problem. Yeah, I've been to this town before. I remember that truck back there. myself out of holding it in there. Oh, that guy's passing up and around a bit of a blind corner. I just have a look. Look how fast that biplane's going. I think it was a pit special or a Christian Eagle or something. But it isn't. to go. Oh, I got a bit of a late jump there. Yeah, it would have been really nice to have that roof pivot cam going through here. Yeah, there's a the long freight train. Could have had a good look at that. It's pretty cool. I haven't used that mod in a long time. I haven't, well, obviously I haven't used this profile in a long time. After 100 yards, turn right. Turn right. Oh, just missed that one. Mustang and Camaro convention. Aren't they supposed to race when they get together? Ford versus Chevy. Socorro, 82. That looks like another road. Oh yeah, look at him go. Oh, look at the train here. It's like volcanic uh, rock. So this skin was actually, uh, you know, I kind of thought of it, and, you know, it'd be a good idea, and uh, maybe I should, and uh, I was thinking about this one, I was thinking about putting it on the K100, and uh, then driver 47, who's working with recon, suggested it, and I thought, darn, ugh, 
you know, other people are thinking it too. Maybe it's a good idea. So he, he mentioned it about a week ago or so, and maybe more. But I was having all those problems with my skinning PC. I just still have problems. I still don't have everything off it, but I'm just so tired of trickling the data off it. I need that. Yeah, I unplugged that drive and everything runs quickly again. And so I managed to get uh, all my XML files, all my truck folders, everything migrated to a different drive and I'm able to do skins and everything again but I don't have my skinning resources folder which is a real bummer because that's got a lot of good stuff in that I've built up over the last couple of years. All my logos and things, ones that I've made and uh, my script uh, for, you know, worthwhile script that I've kept things like that I can just take it off another truck but uh, for now that's what I'll have to do until I can get that sorted but it's always nice to use the originals because they're crisper you copy them too many times and it seems to reduce the quality well that's quite the place out here I'm gonna try for a better photo so, oh, not, not one where I'm driving off the road. Light was nice there. Okay, this is the final little jaunt into Socorro. We're going to rail export. Well, I guess these uh, weanlings are heading out of town or heading out of state on a train. It's been kind of a bummer on the... How far can they go on a train before the train has to stop and water them? And a good way to take that trip to uh, knock a hundred and some miles off it and uh, see something different along the way. hop in and see where we gotta go. Oh, another lane be a start.
been to this rail export here. I must have, like, I've been to that thing all over. Because, uh, we're doing the, like, before I, before I start doing the, uh, low boy, or the videos, I was taking the triple low boy everywhere you could think. And I've, uh, yeah, I've been in this one. That was... I could just entertain myself with that triple low boy and I'll sleep. But you guys don't want to see that all the time. But, you know, I kind of overcompensate in the wrong direction and I just... I don't drive it enough now. Last time we had it out was with the... Um, the old 281 slash 351. Actually 351 because we had the, duo, the uh, tandem. might be where I'm going to throw that rear axle up, get ourselves a little extra maneuvering ability here. So you can change that in preferences. I it's called automatic lift axle or something like that. Just turn that off. Here's the boss. Left it too late for the turn. Let's see if we can just slam it in here. Yeah, there we go. All right, there we are. Uh, lights, cameras, no action. I have to remember to fuel this one up too. Wow, good pay. Not bad, almost 20,000. Wow, that's pretty good. So, there we are. The uh, skin's up on Steam, of course, by now, and um, I'll put a link in the uh, description and a link to the uh, trailer skin. It'll be on Trucky, and you can get the uh, uh, truck skin on Steam. Anyway, uh, thanks for following along, guys, as always. I appreciate it, and... Uh, Catch you on the next one. Take care and bye for now.